New at five packing is underway at downtown Memphis's historic Cossett Library in preparation for a big facelift in the new year. WMC Action News 5's Kendall Downing is live with how you can get involved. Kendall. Hi, Kanji. Library staff say they're actually looking for volunteers to come down here and help pack up. Now, the library will be closing on Saturday, hopefully reopening sometime in late spring or early summer. This is really an amazing time for this particular part of downtown. It's a day after Christmas and boxes here are getting wrapped. Books at the Cossett Library making their way upstairs for months of story. This particular location is so uh, rich with history, such an amazing place. The Cossett in downtown Memphis was the city's first public library, opening in 1893. Lemoyne Owen students staged a sit-in here during the civil rights movement in the 1960s. Older portions of the building will remain untouched, but the newer front areas added on in the 1950s are the ones set to be modernized, the renovation costing at least $3 million. Where this exit sign is, all the way to the glass, um, we're putting an acoustic sound curtain. The end result may look more like a neighborhood coffee shop, new book collections, combined with a cafe and courtyard, co-working space, and even a performance area. It's kind of a new era of what it means to be a library, to be a community hub, to be a space where all people are welcome. Library manager Shamichael Hallman says tourists have even mistaken the library for a disco club with its multicolored exterior lights. Have no fear, they aren't dimming. Lights will definitely stay there. We hear so many positive things from uh, citizens and tourists as they ride by Front Street. Yeah, you can see the lights are on here tonight. So you can stop by and volunteer. They're asking from 11 until 1 or 6 until 8 uh, for the remainder of this week. And this branch does serve as a warming location for the homeless uh, during the cold months like this one that we are in. Staff members here are trying to find a temporary location, but the Crenshaw branch on Vance is about a mile and a half away. Reporting live tonight in downtown Memphis, Kendall Downing, WMC Action News 5.